offense this morning. Paris Todd getting loose. Acquired for that. For Megan Design and that deal. And we are underway here. Third match of the day on championship court. One zero. Just a nightmare start for the sliders who, as we mentioned, have been struggling. We knew that the fives would come out flying, but uh, to just give it to them to start is not ideal, obviously. Todd and Anna Lee, they've had their battles in singles yes. day. That's a tremendous rivalry. Callie and Mari, though, interesting to see how these two match up. Yeah, you're going to see a lot of cross-court dinking with cuts. And there's the slice return. So the only challenge with the slice return is the ladies that like to drive it or hit topspin. The ball keeps spinning in the same way, so you're actually feeding that unless you get it low. She gets it super low a lot of the time, though. Yeah. This is a great response because in rally scoring, you want to stay in sight within three or four throughout, and then you can make a run at the end. You don't want that to be seven or eight, especially against Anna Lee. So the put away by Humber, Dave, you mentioned briefly the conditions, just over 90 degrees until the sun goes down. Yeah, it's hot. The ball's playing slower than it certainly did in Virginia Beach when uh, the Carvana PBA Tour was there in the 70s, about 10 days ago. side is isolate so make her Four, get five. her a little antsy to get the ball so you're gonna see Humberg see a lot of action oh, yes. because stuff like that happens Drew I mean that's a clean winner when the other team feels pretty good about where they're at I shocked for you to see Anna Lee and Will Howes not able to extend that match against Orlando earlier today. Quite, quite surprised. But hey, this is MLP. There's exactly. pros on the other side, too. Oh, yeah. And, uh, you know, that's a terrific win for the squeeze who have a lot of matches left. They made the trade. They like it. So look out. And the big thing, Drew, is the teams that are trying to catch up. There's three points available. If you get to the Dream Breaker, you can only get two. But if you win it before the Dream Breaker and get all three standings points, you can make up ground in a hurry. Kelly Smith just deep. Coming in hot, just missed the ponytail of Anna Lee Waters there. Eight, five. All right, Paris Todd drops one in the back corner. Yeah, that's great. She knows that Anna Lee loves to poach going to her left, so keep that paddle out in front. Just watch this. Keep your paddle out in front. Perfect by Paris. Got it! Got to admit, Dave, I was a bit surprised to see that trade. Paris Todd for Megan Desaad. I thought Paris would be a fixture in Orlando. Yeah, she and Viv, for whatever reason, just weren't playing great as a team, and uh, they wanted to switch it up. Megan Design has some titles in Major League Pickleball with the Seattle Pioneers last year. I had her on that team. When she's going great, it is fantastic. So they, they like her on the left with Viv, and obviously the Squeeze are playing very well here, so they feel great about what's happened. Nine, seven. Right out, right in. 
Yeah, and this is a weekend where all sorts of players are wanting to prove that I shouldn't have been traded, I should have been traded, I, I'm worth this, I'm worth that. It's, uh, it's fun to see players that play an individual sport in a team environment and how they react to it. Mari Humberg with the put away. Yeah, so that's the interesting thing about Mari is we talk about the slice all the time, but she has a forehand roll, and then her put away power is very good. And eight. Got bronze with Georgia Johnson and Virginia Beach. <laughs> Humberg's got some hands, too. Yes. Yeah, some awkward hands there, but it worked. Paris a little uh, off balance herself and pulled it wide. 9-11. So you want that ball to spin out and then sit there for you, but if you don't time it well and get on underneath the ball like Callie 12, did nine. not there, you're going to find the net. New teammate. There's a couple little jab steps there, and to Orlando earlier this morning. Well, Mari made about three messes there. She cleaned up one, and Lee cleaned up one, but the third mess was just a mess. <laughs> Yeah, so Mari will take that backhand roll back across, and you run out of real estate in a hurry, but she can get it down. That's great, because Callie favors the forehand in the middle so much to find that left hip is terrific from Mari. Because the minute Paris ran over there, Callie followed behind and crossed and was ready. That was nice. Watch this movement from the ladies. Callie knew exactly where to go. Bangs a winner on the Pickleball Central replay. Columbus now within one. You hate to follow up that beautiful poach play with just a nothing miss in the midcourt. Obviously, Dave, it's tough. New teammate, Paris, Callie, don't normally play together, and you got a seasoned duo on the other side. Yeah, they played all year as a with the big red nose and the big shoes as a clown, so uh, they definitely have the chemistry advantage here. How about Callie Smith with the great defense paying off? Yeah, I mean, you have two great athletes, scrappy on the far end, and they're right there. So it's the fifth ball that Callie needs to clean up because she's getting underneath that cut of Mari on the return now. So she's on that. It's the next ball she's got to perfect. Oh, guess who got caught with their hand in the cookie jar? A.L. Dove. What a shot from Paris. Here we go. Here we go. 
See a clean winner and raise you. 16 all now. Dave, you mentioned that slice from Humberg. Are you surprised how often she does it? Does she need to do it that often? Uh, it's her thing. Mm -hmm. She should do your thing. That's why I love pickleball. There's no right way to play it. There's a right way for you to play it, and that's the way she chooses to do it. It's unique, and it works mm. for her, and I love that she stays with it. Mm. She'll drive the forehand top spin, but if it's on the backhand, You'll see it right here on the return. Watch slice of Rama right here. <laughs> Get out the Ginsu. <laughs> so cool, you talk about styles. Lindsey Newman sat here last night and said, when Riley and I started, players, young players coming up, and also coaches who probably will you know, not buy into some of the, of the different styles, but do what you do well, I think, yes. is so important. Yeah, there's a great business book, Soar With Your Strengths. Just accentuate those and make it work. Look at this. So far, that New Jersey sideline, a little bit quiet, a little bit sedated. Yeah, where's the one, two, three, four? Where's the counting? Where's the Sesame Street? Show us you can count to five. Nothing. Sneaks one in, and now we're tied at 19. And there's another mess in the center there as Callie's right there, but Paris isn't sure, so she reaches her paddle out. That's called changing her mind mid-swing right there. She's going to fire it at Annalie. You can tell then changed her mind and made bad contact. So the fact the chemistry is not completely on point, Dave, and they are not at a 20. Tells you how well they're playing. Because there's been a few things where you want to play complimentary pickleball. You want to talk about who's covering the middle ball. And they're able to overcome that against a very good team on the other side. And it's anybody's game. When you get to the 20s in rally scoring, now you've got to execute. We'll see who does down the stretch. then you're reversing the spin, trying to cut it back, and that is hard to do. And Humberg wins that battle cross court to get the lead. Yeah. And that's a great job by Humberg. Could you heard her say, watch out. So she Three points away from taking game one. Paris, which is a good ball, but I want Callie to jump in front of that and destroy it. Right here, right here. Not sure where to be on 20, the court 20, with 20. her partner. What comes next, Dave? Practice, communication, just more talking? Yes, all of it. I mean, 
just getting, I mean, court time is number one there. Mm -hmm. And then a lengthy discussion, and maybe they've had it, maybe they haven't, but if the ball's coming from which angle, who takes what, and then you got to just practice. 24-20. Game point here. And there it is. So it's Waters and Humbert weathering the storm. And what a charge late to take it. Yes, yeah, 20 apiece. And we talked about who's going to execute down the. Time in. So it's Bellamy. Zero, zero. And Newman. And on the other side, Navarro and Will House. And that sums up the sliders last couple of days right there. Slides off and you can't even touch it. One, zero. Oh, welcome to championship court on a Tuesday, Roscoe. Wow. Roscoe Bellamy. A lot of people think of him as the future of pickleball. Talk about an opportunity here, catching on with Columbus. Two clean winners off the bounce here. Yeah, Roscoe actually jumped in with the squeeze when Paris was still on that team. The whole team got sick. He jumps in, helps them win a match. It was wild. So he's definitely had some results. Little drop. Second time's the charm for Howells. And you mentioned Roscoe Bellamy had that big singles win over Ben Johns here in Vegas. Yes, he did. And uh, then, unfortunately, hurt his foot and had to scratch mid-match on the match after that. So it's, what an unfortunate way to follow up the biggest win of your career. Boy, we were boxing out for the rebound there. <laughs> but it worked out. Riley Newman, 20 times the PPA Tour gold medalist. What a career this guy has had. chirping here in this match. Yeah, R Riley hasn't met a match that doesn't deserve Four, a whole three. bunch of that, and Will will give it back to him, too. Yeah. Beautiful slide there from Roscoe. Again, same idea that I talked about earlier. Mari with the forehand on the left side. Five, the right side player just needs to fill the middle with the two handed backhand. Perfectly done there from Roscoe. Yeah, yeah. And there's the presence of Riley Newman in the middle, forces that wide volley. Great start for those sliders. You know, they got the little White Castle hint in the low. You want me to tell off do it quickly? Okay. Howard Hepworth ain't having any <laughs> long delays with the towel over here. He is dialed in, isn't he? He is. Thanks to all the referees. Davis a player. All the shade on the court. Does it pose an issue One these players? thousand percent. It's changing color in and out. If you even lose it for a tenth of a second for how fast they're hitting it. There's the side that Riley and Roscoe are on is probably the worst right now because you're having to squint through it right now. It's coming right in at you. In the two matches I worked yesterday, I've never seen so many players tagged as I have. So obviously having a hard time just picking that up sometimes. 100%. Mm -hmm. 
game is also getting faster. So those sure. unexpected and non-appointment tattoo parlor visits are creeping up. Dave Navratil makes a play. And there's no, you know, Roscoe is fine on that ball in the middle because he's so big. He's got that easily covered. If I'm at the park and I see these two guys, Bellamy and, <laughs> and Riley Newman, they are some imposing figures. I'll tell you what. Yeah, you, you assume there is a uh, Wilson basketball uh, around them somewhere. Eight <laughs> six. Hip, so the tall guys have a lot more body to cover, so that's great. Great for Will and slower, so you will see people counter better because it's not coming back quite as fast as it usually does. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Tell you what, right now, New Jersey, they are rolling. That's the sky hook from Riley there. 10-6. Yeah, and you mentioned the bus. Uh, the wheels are falling off the bus right now. This is an amazing run. Eight nothing in favor of New Jersey. Just left it up. Zane knew what to do with it. Yeah, placement over power there. Just throw it down. These guys got to bend. Make the big. I'm 5'8". I love when the big guys have to bend because I can't reach what they can, but I can get down low quicker than they can. Oh, this is what a mess. Out of Phoenix, Arizona right now trying to get it together. Ian Roscoe Bellamy just conceded 10 straight points to the fives trying to stop the bleeding. I mean, the wheels on the bus are supposed to go round and round, and they ain't going at all here. They are flat. credit that you called out they they haven't been loud they're up a game in 15-7 though turn this around. I'd like you to see them get back when they get the ball back. Drive and crash. Let Mosco rip those. Bodies. But it's been a series of unforced errors that have contributed to that. Another missed return right there right as I'm talking about it. That ball drops in. <laughs> Maybe that's the the break they needed. So let's see what they do here. You know, most teams against Riley return to him, so he's not a threat at the net. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, cocktail hit about three feet deep. 
teams they're just trying to figure out where to be and if you're not sure what shot your partner's going to hit 10. in that position you are a fraction late and that's what happened right there that's a great point yeah. one word kind of sums it up right now for columbus uncertainty yes 19 10. Point. And just do not see that happen with Roscoe Bellamy. Is he a bit disgusted? Point point. Yeah. 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 Roscoe had seen quite enough down his line there, so sad on that one. And uh, Howells will have to put that one away. <laughs> 11-20. Love that. Little off speed, throw some spin at Riley's feet. Great shot from Will there. It's been fun watching. Watching Riley Newman, Dave, come back yeah. quiet the first part of 2024, and then you miss a lot of time. The game just keeps advancing. It's almost like you got to catch up to it a little bit. Yes, you do, and they do not have answers right now. Yeah, no doubt. Uh, he's fun. He has a unique paddle and grip. Um, so we, he is definitely better for our sport from an entertainment value standpoint, and obviously a very good player. Yeah, the uh, red noses in the uh, big shoes are cruising now. Can you, jinx, can you announce or jinx a clown? I think I just did it. Don't see a lot of clowns nowadays, right? But <laughs> no. we, we grew up with clowns, didn't we? That's, that's a good point. They're usually bad now and scary. It's almost Halloween. I want to run from the clowns that show up at Halloween. It. <laughs> 14, 23. Oh, come on, oh. So now game point for the fives. 24, 14. Abertill and Howes have been in cruise control since about the 10 point mark. Finally, Riley Newman gets one in. 1524. Yeah. Yeah. Timeout New Jersey. 1624. Boy, you need Time in. rivalry, and that's yeah. what we have. And then, boy, did that match ever live up to it. Yeah. And this is what got them the 6 3 lead early. So you got to be very specific on your return point. So let's see if Howes can pull this over to Riley, and he does. Yeah, the TP no, is yeah, there yeah. for Howes. It all started with a smart return, then you get the glory on the ATP. Door's not shut no. just yet, Dave. Got a one on your serve, and sometimes that pressure, if they get to 20, that's where the number starts making uh, heartbeats go a little faster. Yeah, Will. Oh. So there's Bellamy reaching in, and Riley's just sitting there ready to block that back in the kitchen. 24-18. Another game point. Wow, you heard Riley say go, and Ro Roscoe did not, but Riley's <laughs> to get in there. This is this concoction these guys are trying to figure out in the middle. 
Okay, there's 20. Temperature here on Humana Championship Court being turned up just a bit. 20, 24. Yeah! Mm, oh, he's so good. Yeah, great first counter from Zane there. Here we go, here we go. Finish it right here. 24, 20. Oh, we call Ember got a win on the serve here. So the five still trying to close out this game. Yeah, Zane's done a great job of being the captain of this team. 24, and 20. Uh, getting them fired up here to come back and play well. So finally, the New Jersey Fives take care of business. 25-20, the same score of yeah. the women's. And Will did figure out a way to pull that one out, but it was definitely a scrap. Mixed doubles underway, game three. As you watch Humberg do her thing. You know this is a long conversation, Dave. We can have certainly at another time, but going to be really interesting to see who some of these teams drop at the end of the season. Good luck to whoever makes those decisions. Yeah, it's not going to be fun for anybody, especially the teams that do very well, because you're basically jettisoning someone that won you a title for whoever wins has to cut somebody. She'll cut the ATP, she doesn't care. She got a full set of cutlery over there. Yeah, the shock who we saw earlier, I, I can't even imagine that decision. You got the two young stud teenagers, but Kate Fahey's one of the hottest females on going, and then obviously you're not cutting the captain no. AB, so uh, that's gonna be something to behold. Good start here for the fives. And just to be clear on the rule, yes, you must cut a player. You can cut more. Mm -hmm. um, but for the teams that have the great chemistry, they're going to have to figure that out. Another brilliant shot by Humberg. Yeah, she does such a great job with that one-handed backhand roll usually will bring that hard back cross court, but that hung up so well and pretzeled up Paris. Yeah, let it go, and how about saying never till Dave, all this guy does is win MLP titles four times a champion. Yeah, him and Arena and Ben Johns has won more than his share, but those three are the MLP just they just dominate. Again the array of of cuts we are seeing it. Just got a lot of knives in that kitchen. Yep. from Mari, but Zane did a spin around, just full swing defense just to save his body, and it went in. Yeah. And Paris Todd finally with an answer. Yes, yeah, so let's see if that's the catalyst for these two, because again, the slider's rough, rough going.
great defense of the ATP. Yeah, and when one's cutting it and one's hitting topspin, that ball just keeps spinning in the same direction faster and faster because you keep those revolutions going. I hope that we get more of that. It's fun to watch. Did he get line? He did not. Mm. Just not quite wide enough. He'd given her a couple looks. <laughs> what a lob from Paris. Now back to back sliders within two. Yeah. And there is Paris Todd once again. And again, the paddle out in front and the reload. Because she doesn't get cheated on the two handed backhand cuts. And then it's right there. That's really nice from Paris. Dave, she came into the world of pickleball mainly just a singles player. The evolution of her doubles game has been fun to watch. Yeah, she's terrific in all events. Yeah, and the other obvious big decision that the Fives made at the midseason tournament is playing Mari on her more comfortable side than left and having Riley, or excuse me, having Zane play the right, and it works. Usually you'll see a lefty guy play on the right side, so you have that forehand in the middle, but uh, he is seeding that to Mari so that she's playing her more comfortable side, and it is working. And that takes ego out of it and none on this team. That's why I said Zane's a great captain. What makes our team the best? And this, this is the lineup that does it. Yep. Battle, too much never till. And Humberg, 13 9. Oh, sorry. Wow. Mm. Paris got tagged. Yeah, the World Championships are going to be incredible. There's a big kickoff event there Let's today. Go. My man John Isner showed up for that. They played some pickle up in the Reunion Tower, which is that ball that uh, is so iconic in the Dallas skyline. So, so much fun coming. And Major League Pickleball will be there at the front end. Much needed point there for Columbus. And they trail by four. 10-14. Again, Mari is sliding and just daring you to hit it in the air there and destroyed Paris again. That's a two-shot combo. 16, you don't see him miss that very often. 
The hat is backwards for Riley Newman. Let's see if it's a rally gap, so he gets a miss from Amari. So uh, the shadows are a factor, and I think they're on the worst side. So he's not even going to use the brim part of it to help him. It's a little run here. Answered by the sliders, trying to keep this match alive. We will play a game four no matter what. 13-16. Yeah, great job by Mar. If you don't have to protect one side of your body, it's good. It's your fans are going to be faster. 17-13. That's wide. Number get of Sao Paulo, Brazil, 14, 28 years old. Side out, point 18. And combined, should we not? I think most of the uh, of the belief here is we should not combine, let Major League Pickleball stand on its own. So look for keep the good and uh, make make a lot of tweaks to the rest. The premier challenger system, too. You like it? Uh, I think that will eventually um, be a thing of the past. But, uh, really? yes, teams are trying to obviously earn their way into premier right now at the challenger level. Yeah, I think I think you want all the players playing against each other, and over time, I think the, the level we're going to have so many new players. Kate Fahey, who was on the shock, we saw she was a project manager at American Express in April. <laughs> See how long all of the changes and tweaks happen, and I think you'll see stuff start next year and then continue to evolve. Cannot wait to see where MLP goes in the future. But for now, let's enjoy it yes. for what it is. We got a great postseason ahead of us. Yeah, and that's a miss Paris can't have on the comeback trail when your team has to have this win. Now Columbus trying to make a final push here. Within three, very much in it. And now a two-point kick. One stop, one stop. So that timeout came at the right time here for Columbus. That's the momentum, Dave. Yeah, and they returned to Paris, and that she made him pay, and there was no doubt at time. Rolling. So we are tied at 20, with Paris Todd now serving. Straight. Yeah, and Riley slid over and expected a ball right at him, and uh, Mari pulled it right down the middle. Great shot. Scared. She fires away. I don't care if it's 4 2 or 22 20. Good defense by Zane. Oh, man. 
Oscar the Grouch on the Burt right there as he dug it out and Riley had exactly Let's what go. he wanted. Can't believe he didn't win that rally. One of the best points we've seen today, won by Columbus. Yeah, got a little help off the net cord and right there. And let's see if they can get to the kitchen. Where's the return going to go? Let's see if they go to Riley. There's only one timeout per team, so there's no timeouts available here either. Dickens here, 23 Indeed. all. One stop here, one stop. On. Paris Todd takes a moment. Here we go, one stop, here we go. Columbus here on the doorstep. Too much open court. Great defense of the ATP. And look at who gets to game point first. Columbus. Dave, you said it. Something different about go, this duo, go. Todd and Newman. They have fought it off here. although the battle was a little low that time. To just take court, see if they can get uh, under Will House in a little bit, but Anna Lee is going to be motivated. That is not a good start. Roscoe Feldman with that UCLA pedigree, just 24 years old. So much great pickleball he's got ahead of him. Callie Smith answers. Yeah, the big question with Roscoe is, does he elevate again? And is, is there more? And it's moments like this that you prove there is more. This is a chance to get your team to a dream breaker against the best female in the world. Let's see. Let's see what he brings to the table. Had a chance, too, to work with him in the commentating booth, yeah. Dave, in Grand Rapids and also in New York as Callie Smith adjusts the shoe. And as much as he had fun working with me, you could just sense, I want to be on that court. 100%. Not one alternate wants anything but to be called, and he was here. So 
That gives him the chance. Yeah, and that's the no-go zone right there. If you want to drive it high above the net into the end of the two-hander, you're just like, what did your partner do to you? That's like lofting it over the middle and you're a wide receiver and you got some Pittsburgh Steelers secondary yeah. waiting for you, right? Minka's waiting. <laughs> The fundamentals have got to be cleaned up right here because you cannot just give layups to an AL dub. Guns are blazing here in game four. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Five, three. Dominant force with Ben Johns. Mixed doubles on the Carvana PPA Tour. Oh, my. It's a big jump of the corner from Roscoe. Looked good, and it got bunny back and flying through the air like one of the Cirque du Soleil act actors or actresses, and uh, Will pushes it deep. Two just drives that they didn't let's get go, let's go. a sniff of the kitchen. Yeah. Only again, going right after Roscoe Bellamy. Yeah, the, the left side guy might just cheat a little with the with the paddle in the middle, Number right four. down the line, and then went back there again. I love it. Short that time from Bellamy when you watch Will Howes play, Dave. His first year in MLP just looks so comfortable. He's blended in so well. Yes, very talented athlete. Not easy, as I've mentioned before. Same thing with Mari. You're playing mixed with the best player in the world. First one, but can't reload the second one there. Yeah, when you watch Roscoe Bellamy play, I know Dave, everybody's got to do their own thing. Would you like to see him maybe get a little bit lower in the <laughs> kitchen? Because it does seem like players are attacking his body. Yeah, it's, it's, it's the blessing and the curse of 6 5. Yes. Yeah, So players adapting based on their their own biology. Timeout, sliders still concede another. An eight point lead for the fives. Callie Smith goes for it. Why not? What a move. Yeah, and there's no question that Callie and Roscoe are on the side that's tougher. So you want to get closer with the sun that we talked about coming in there and obviously it's hitting Roscoe in a different spot than almost every other human being that's here. Let's go. And that will take us to our first break here in game. And Callie here. And Will House comes out of the timeout doing his thing and Dave. 
if there is a six and seven scenario where they're tied in points. What determines the tiebreaker? Yeah, break? so then we get into games one, and that's why we play the fourth. And uh, it could happen. Mm -hmm. the way to use your wrist because you can find angles with that long arm of the law for Roscoe right there. Roscoe's like, I'm engaged, I'm hitting this thing. Nice job by Cali. So right now you trail by seven, Dave. Just put it all on the table. Why not? Yeah, you just can't set the table for the other team. So uh, that ball's got to get down. House does a great job with the one-handed backhand, a guy who rips the tune back in from the baseline. But he's got both. Takes it right back where it came from. after day one, Dream Breakers. Only one match yesterday went to a Dream Breaker out of the 10 that were played. Yeah, a lot of uh, convincing victories here. And thanks for bringing up the one that my team lost. <laughs> <Appreciate that trip. laughs> St. Louis defeating Carolina, by the way. Yeah, nice job of finding that uh, right hip there. So uh, it is G.O. time. Impressive punch right there. And Annalie's not interested in disguising anything there. Like, look, the rabbit is out of the hat, and here comes the rabbit right at you. says it's out. Callie Smith is going to challenge here. Annalie called it in. Side out point nine. Annalie called it in. Who's calling it out? Annalie called it in. Side out point nine. So it will be a point here for Columbus. Yeah, I think if this was 1918, we would be having a different situation here. Well said. of the jersey. That was a tag. Well, Hal's going to remember that. Bob's continuing to run away with it here. Yeah, Roscoe's trying to create there and just pulls it wide. Also want to remind everybody, coming up next, still one more match here on the Humana Championship Court. Yes, we've got an old school Texas shootout coming your way. Yes. Dallas, the Flash, taking on the Texas Ranchers. Yeah. Yeah, another injury situation there for the Ranchers with no Christian Alshon. So Anderson Scarpa, let's hope they have extra jerseys. My boy was 
giving it his all out there. Yeah, he has really showed out. Oh, man, a lead. Yeah, you take one jab step to the middle, and that ball is just sitting there, and she feasts on that, and this is uh, a blowout. Got that punch from that right hip that is very, very good. Popularized to start with by the great Matt Wright. And that will drop in as far as players who do that really well. Matt Wright, Ben Johns, would you say, of course? Absolutely. Well, Howes, his brief time in the game, the way he's perfected it, so impressive. And now on the brink here, it is match point. 24-11. There it is again, Dave. Just unstoppable. Yeah, the fives had the matchup they wanted to end this match. On Humana Championship Court, as the sun starts to go down here in Las Vegas. All right, guys, and Mari, we'll start with you. Unexpected uh, bumpy road this morning, but you guys bounced back quickly. What did you guys tell each other after coming up short earlier in the day? It, this was our last match, our last day of competition, this event. So leave it all out there is all we talked about. You know, uh, teams played well this weekend. So props to the Orlando Squeeze this morning. Uh, Columbus Sliders competed hard as well. So we just wanted to bring as much energy as possible and finish it off. And Will, on the other side, you got Riley Newman, you got Roscoe Bellamy. Those guys are an imposing presence. But you and Zane just just did your thing. You guys went right after them. Yeah, uh, we, were, we were pretty tired going to this match. The, the moral of the story here was just uh, be resilient and uh, stay disciplined, you know. Don't get free points, and, and obviously they're a super tough team. They bring a lot of offense to the table, so long points there. Well, Dave Fleming and I were talking also on the broadcast about your punch and how good that shot has become for you. How often do you work on that? Tell us about perfecting it. Yeah, a lot. Shout out to, uh, to J-Dub, actually. He uh, took me under his wing when I first started playing. And uh, I, I learned a lot from, uh, from him and, and playing with him. So. And Mari playing next to Annalie Waters. She has had an incredible grind here over the last several days. Do you feel like you've had to maybe put a little bit more on your plate to help out your teammate? I mean, she's. She's her, right? She, she can take as much court as she wants, but I told her, hey, you have a teammate. You know, you can trust me over here. Take as much as you want, but I got your back if you need me. Uh, I think this last match, she needed me a little bit more than usual. But, uh, yeah, no, she's incredible. I mean, props to her for, for being able to stick this one out. It's all about teamwork for the Fives. Guys, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. New Jersey Fives, victorious again here at MLP Las Vegas.